this is where Los Angeles gets its power from. Hi! How are you? As you can tell, it's kind of noisy here. Yeah, so this is where Southern California gets its power from. Southern California Edison uh, power plant. Three around. Ah, uh, let's see. Okay. You look at the map, uh, Huntington Lake is way up there. And the water that you're seeing coming out of the generators and the turbines comes down those pipes. There you go. So they come down those pipes into the turbines and then that runs the generators that the power is lost. Los Angeles. Isn't that freaking cool? These are all these giant projects they were doing in the uh, early part of the 20th century. You saw my, uh, my old videos on the red car and the Larry, uh, which had, these were all built for the power of, purpose of uh, powering those things. That's where the electricity came from to power the Los Angeles Railroad and the Pacific Electric Railway, okay? Or the red car. Yeah, so uh, I've discovered a, uh, a lady nearby who's got an old cabin that was run by the railroad that was built near the Friant Dam in order to get the material to construct all this. So I found a lady that uh, literally lives in a, uh, a cabin that used to be a station, a very primitive station for the railroad. And this is this is the uh, right of way right here of the railroad. What they would do is like they go that way. It was a uh, bridge right about there. They'd go across. Go across right about there. Then they'd uh, go up there. They'd back up, and then they'd have this incline cable run system that got the material way the hell up there. You can imagine that. Really steep grade like like this. But they'd have a cable system that drags stuff up there so they could build all that stuff up there. Huntington Dam. Right. So that's, that's the next, uh, that's a future video is about this uh, San Joaquin and Eastern Railroad. Did, uh, that was built by the Southern California Edison Company to get their materials up here so they could build all this. Alright, so stay tuned. This is the back of the turbine building. This is the feedstock pipes as they enter. And coolest thing. Oh, by the way, that's, that's my truck. 
Don't look like much, but that's how I moved from LA to up here. Alright, so there's there's the pipes. And there's the railroad. Literally, they'd, they'd have a cable system so they could just drag stuff up to the top. And it's still here, a century later. Ooh. Bumblebee, it's a clover right here. Yeah. Oh my god, you can really hack up this. Oh, there it is right there. Wow, yeah, this this would be a freaking excellent. There you go. It's one of the um, I wonder if they still turn. Yeah, those things are jammed shut. Rusted shut. Woo! Holy crap. Yeah, but right now there's Tons of water coming down through this thing so they can run the turbines in the generator. Woohoo! There's another one up there, so. Wow. I'm surprised they still had this. Most of it was uh, most of it was sold for scrap. I think bought by the Japanese. So there she goes. Oh man, this would be a freaking nice little uh it's a nice nice hiking trail. You can go right up to Shea Huntington Lake on this. I think. I'm not sure. I'll find out. Then we'll try it. Yeah, this is this is extremely steep. So and I came with I didn't have much for breakfast except for a banana, a little cereal. So I gotta have a big, big, big breakfast before I, I hike up that thing. Cause you're gonna climb a thousand or a couple thousand feet. Pretty cool, though. Of course, you can drive up there if you want. That's the easy way. Okay. There she goes. That's where LA gets its electricity from. Way up there. Thanks. 